This is lot 10E. This is the custom Wentworth Gourmet Kitchen. This is built by one of the best cabinet makers in the country, master woodworker Robbie Wentworth and his team. All top of the line materials. Beautiful, beautiful kitchen. We're gonna sell the perimeter of the kitchen in one lot because it's so huge. And we're gonna sell the island separately. You got more cabinets that you're gonna know what to do with them. All solid wood. Obviously it doesn't include anything inside the cabinets. So real briefly, the dimensions from this wall to that corner over there is 164 inches. Overall dimensions from that corner to that wall right there is 121 and a half inches. The cabinets, you got the uppers right here. The overall height from the floor to the top of the trim is 101 and a half inches tall, 101 and a half. And then you got the top cabinets that sit on the granite. These are 31 inches, so you got a 31 inch cabinet and it's 59 and a half inches <clears throat> without the trim and 66 with the trim. So it's pretty much that all the way around. This little corner right here measures 53 and a half inches from the edge of the wall oven to the wall. This corner right here measures 47 and a half inches. From this pillar right here to there is 73 and a half inches. The total height right here all the way to the top of the trim not all the way to the top of the ceiling, but right there is 110 inches. 110 inches. We are gonna throw in the exhaust hood. And then you have this wall right here. This is from this wall right here to there is 159 inches. This cabinet section right here is 66 inches by 48 inches tall. Then from this corner to that corner is 149 inches. So it's 149 inches to the bottom of the seating area right there. And then to the end is 161 inches, 161 inches. Then you have the seat in bar area right here. From here to the wall, from here to the wall is 97 inches and this little corner right here is 47 and a half inches. Right here you got a double stainless steel sink, pull down faucet. You have also a water chiller right there and a garbage disposal. This is the garbage area right here. We are going to include the ASCO dishwasher. If you want to keep it, that's fine. It's workable. It's an older model, but it has the paneling. And you got plenty of storage all the way around. You got a Lazy Susan right here. Got a lot of storage. Look at this, guys and girls. This is solid, solid wood. You don't see cabinets like this very often. If you were to buy a cabinet like this right here alone, probably be $1,500 to $2,000 just for this one cabinet. This is the best of the best. I'm going to make another video of the island separately. We are going to have a preview, so you can come look at the kitchen in person if you're interested.